Hey Capricorn, I'm here to do your reading. This will be a reading for the sign of Capricorn, <clears throat> the highly requested reading, Capricorn. Um, this is for the next seven days. Happy Valentine's Day. Capricorn, next seven days. What does Capricorn need to know? Advice, obstacles they face, what do they need to know? Love. So I see you standing in your power. You could possibly be dealing with the Leo. I see you looking really, really beautiful. This could be like you taking pictures, like you uh, taking some new pictures. I see. You're going to receive some type of truth here. Someone is going to break their silence to you. Someone is doing some spying in the next seven days. They're unhappy. Capricorn, they want higher levels of commitment or they're, they're consulting in the God source or they're consulting in the higher levels of uh, the higher power I'm getting. They don't want something to transition here. They don't want something to end because I see an ending coming. You could be dealing with a Scorpio Capricorn. No for Capricorn. <laughs> okay, so whatever this is, you know about it. You have the High Priestess here. So I'm getting you know about this, whatever this is. You know that you have to move on. You know that you're going to move on victorious in the next seven days. I'm getting that for you. You could be on your way to some type of party or some type of gathering. I see someone offered you to come, though. They offered for you to come. But you could be tight on money right now. Definitely. You could be tight on money. So you may be, like, weighing your options on if you should go or not in the next seven days. More um, Scorpio energy here, Capricorn. Yeah, you may not just have you may not have um the proper clothes to wear. I see you like not having your clothes together, or this could be like your hair, your hair isn't done. You're just not prepared for this, for this invite here. More for Capricorn next seven. So you have your energy popping out, Capricorn. So I'm seeing that you have some type of attachment with a Scorpio. Heavy Scorpio energy here. Pisces energy. So I see something is suspended. Someone could be trying to stop you from doing something. They're trying to keep you bound. Someone is trying to keep you bound here. They're waiting for some type of results. They're waiting for a specific result here in this situation. You could be waiting for communication in the next seven days from someone. Could be a Capricorn or a Pisces, another Capricorn or a Pisces, I'm seeing. You could be waiting for a Pisces. Capricorn, have your energy here. Next seven days for Capricorn. So I see you trying to manifest something. Be very careful. I see someone very manipulative around you. The Queen of Swords. So they upset you in some way or they will be within the next seven days. I'm seeing that here. But I'm also seeing someone be highly manipulative and plot. They're plotting something. They're plotting to scheme, scam, or steal something here. Someone could be doing work here. You have the Devil and the Magician. Someone could be doing black magic they could be playing in like um the dark arts capricorn i'm getting it's a scorpio They could be trying to disturb your dreams or disturb something going on with your sleeping. 
They could be trying to cause you to be restless here. I see like candle magic, Capricorn. So someone is trying to manipulate a Virgo here, Capricorn, something like that here. Because you have the Ace of Cups and then you have the Hermit Reverse. So I'm getting someone is trying to genuinely manipulate a Virgo or they're genuinely feeling this way about a Virgo. Someone is not able to explore their options here in the next seven days. I see someone being unstable as well. They're not even um they're not even ready for this. They're not even ready to do this. They're not even ready to uh they're just not prepared. So I'm getting a sense for you need you needing to uh choose a new direction, Capricorn, in the next seven days. You need to be ready to choose a new direction here. <clears throat> Yes, within your relationship dynamic, whoever you're dating or dealing with, I see you choosing a new direction here. Page of Pentacles. Judgment reversed. Hmm. So someone is not offering what you want. They're not even offering you at all. Someone made a bad judgment here, possibly dealing with a Virgo Capricorn. Someone made a really, really bad judgment. Someone made a bad judgment here. So someone possibly like chose the wrong person. I'm seeing that. Someone chose the wrong person, chose the wrong direction. More for Capricorn. The Emperor, the Six of Swords, reversed. So whoever this person is, they're really angry with you, Capricorn, because they chose the wrong direction because they're um, not able to move forward. There's a lot of petty arguments going on here, a lot of petty conflict. This is just small stuff, though. Like bullshit, like someone missed their opportunity so like they're mad or something like mad with you i'm getting that they're angry with you they made a wrong judgment a bad judgment and they're mad with you so they want to argue with you i see things changing in the future this is like some good karma coming around for you capricorn within the next seven days actually i see things changing so like these petty arguments and uh, fights, they could uh, succeed, they could stop within the next seven days. I see you coming out of heartbreak within the next seven days. Someone's coming out of like manipulation tactics. Um, I'm getting they don't want to argue and fight no more. They're not being petty and vindictive. I'm hearing, I'm hearing vindictive, Capricorn, whoever you're dealing with here. Things are just not moving forward with this person. There's something that you're unaware of with the moon card, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio energy here. You're just not aware of something here. So I'm getting things are not going to move forward in this situation. You're not able to take action or this person is not able to take action towards you. Possibly because they made a, wrong, a bad judgment. A bad choice, wrong choice here. Something like that. <coughs> More for Capricorn. So I see something came to an end here. We have the Ten of Swords. Something definitely ended. Possibly dealing with the past person, Capricorn. Yeah, you don't have any faith in this past person anymore. I'm getting that. They cause you a lot of stress. You're focused on your happiness here. They're not... Yeah, they lost their light in your life. I'm saying that they lost the light in your life. They ha they no longer have that space. They no longer have that um that stardom, that power. They no longer had that power over you, Capricorn. 
within the next seven days, I'm seeing that. I'm also seeing some of you in a relationship, really happy in a relationship. Could be dealing with the Leo here, Capricorn. The King of Pentacles reverse. So I'm getting someone could be out of work. It came out reversed and it popped up upright. So I'm getting someone is like, out of work they're not working things are unbalanced for this person definitely out of work king of pentacles came out reverse eight of pentacles came out reverse as clarification for the king of pentacles reversed so i'm getting things are off balance someone is not working they don't have any money nine of pentacles reversed i'm seeing like money they don't have any money their pockets are emptied I'm seeing a need for balance within your finances or this is this person's finances within the next seven days, Capricorn. I'm also seeing a Virgo work on something here. I'm seeing a, a, a Virgo like put something together possibly for you, Capricorn. I see them mixing something up possibly with this temperance card here. I see them actually like mixing things together. This could be a Virgo trying to um, get you into some type of work, Capricorn. I see them wanting some type of work for you. And I don't see you being closed off to the idea, Capricorn, within the next seven days. This could be like a job situation where you're like your boss, they want you to work or something like that definitely a work situation with the three of pentacles work so i see you collaborating within the next seven days you're waiting for your money to come in i see you very low very low on money capricorn or someone around you is very low on money you're waiting for your ships to come in. You're waiting for your money to come in. I see someone being rejected within the next seven days. <clears throat> someone is being rejected or like blocked within the next seven days. Because they're not passionate. They're not passionate about you. They're very dispassionate. The King of Wands reversed. So I'm getting they're dispassionate. They're not passionate at all. They are not active the way you would like them to be, Capricorn. So you're refusing offers here. This person could be very flighty in, in and out. Like they're just in and out of your life. Definitely. Three of Cups. So I see a reunion here. But someone feels like they can't. They don't want to reunite. They're stuck. But this is within the mind. So I'm seeing someone wanting to reunite with you. Or this is you wanting to reunite with someone. But they're not able to right now. Something is just keeping them down. They're not able to see clearly either. But I'm getting it's going to move slow. Knight of Pentacles. It's going to move very, very slow. Whatever this situation is. If this is a love situation... It's going to move very slow. I see you getting a brand new offer from the universe. And you're not going to know what to do. You're going to be going back and forth in your mind, teetering and tottering, whether you should or you should not, whatever this is, whether you should or should not accept this offer, this Ace of Pentacles, because I see you having many offers. Multi-talented person, multi-faceted person. I'm seeing that for you in the next seven days. Someone is disturbed here. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio energy. Someone is disturbed that things are just so hard for them right now. Things are just so rough. This could be you upset about your money. You're very emotional about this money. You're not able to get things off of the ground. Things are just tough for you right now. I'm getting that strongly Capricorn within the next seven days but I see things changing for you with this queen of pentacles so I see you actually getting what you want overall I'm getting this is just temporary 
definitely with the Wheel of Fortune here. This is just temporary. Things will change for you in the near future. It's like you'll transform into the Queen of Pentacles or you have something coming to you. You could have like a parent, uh, some type of mother figure or feminine energy to help you out here when it comes to finances. Capricorn, something is unjust and something is just not stable. Something is just not, there's no stability within that situation because someone is flighty, very in and out. Someone was left out in the cold or they took a trip here. I'm seeing that as well. They took a trip to give to a third party or to someone else. But something is definitely unstable and unjust. And I'm getting you know about that because someone is flighty. They're very in and out. So I'm getting it shows they don't even really have to say anything. <clears throat> Let me get a Moonology card for you. Capricorn. I'm going to take both of those for you. It says, you and your loved ones are safe. The energy is gaining momentum. Yeah, so I was getting that. You're going to transform here. You're going to go through something. I believe you had the um, death card. The death card is like transitions. So I see you transitioning within the next seven days. So you have the death card and you have the high priestess. So you know that you're going through some type of transformation right now. You know about all of this. You know about everything that's going on. There's something that you're unaware of when it comes to this person, though. There's something that you're just not privy to. I'm getting that. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio energy here. Pisces, um, Scorpio energy more. So then cancer energy. But I'm seeing you have a knowing, Capricorn. There's something that you know here. Possibly dealing with this Scorpio or whoever you're dealing with or dating. Some of you are dating a Leo and an Earth sign here. Capricorn. Some of you are missing an Earth sign as well. So you have you and your loved ones are safe. If you're worrying, I believe you had the nine of swords as well. If you're worrying about anything, your family, I see you worried about a family, possibly a mother figure. If you're worried about like um, your loved ones, I'm getting they are safe. Cancer energy here. It could be a cancer that you're dealing with or that you're worried about, Capricorn. I'm getting they are safe. The other card says the energy is gaining momentum. So whatever you're working on or whatever you're trying to work on, because I see you actually needing money, you're trying to put money into something, invest. I'm hearing invest. So whatever you're trying to invest in, I'm getting it's gaining momentum. You'll soon meet your threshold or you'll soon meet your goal that you're looking to reach. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Check my description box where you guys can book a personal reading. Thank you, Capricorn, for watching.